morning YouTube. Today is Friday, August 13th. Yes, you heard it here. Friday the 13th. Today I um, am going to be maybe doing a couple bracelets just kind of relaxing because it is Friday and we've had quite the week with this heat wave. I do want to say first and foremost that by the time this vlog goes up, there will already have been a new personal channel video up. It's a cleaning video, so I know I have a lot of followers when it comes to my cleaning videos, so I hope you guys enjoy. I cleaned the organizer over here behind me yesterday, or um, a couple of days ago, and I filmed that for the other channel. It came out really, really well. My mother is like amazed by it with how much stuff I got off of that organizer. Yesterday I got my hair cut. It's very, very nice trim as you can see. It went a lot shorter this time because, not just because of the heat, because I actually like it shorter like this. A lot shorter, it's more comfortable. There's a side view and then another side view. And then I'll show you guys the back um, in a little bit. But nice shortcut, definitely necessary. Felt really good to just get a good wash, a good massage. Ugh. Thank the Lord for Fridays. This week, uh, it is just, I feel like I've been going, going, going. But then I also had some down days. <clears throat> Sorry for my voice. Sorry. I feel like I've also had some down days. One of which was today and uh, is today and yesterday. Because the only thing I did yesterday was get my hair cut. That's the only thing I did yesterday. And then I'm glad I got home just in time because we had a downpour of rain and some thunder and lightning yesterday afternoon. This entire house got so dark, we had to turn some lights on. It got really, really dark. Uh, and then we had extreme flashes of lightning. It is really dark in here because we have the blind shut. But we had flashes of lightning, some loud thunder. But we survived in this whole heat thing. Um, after today, I think it is supposed to cool down quite a bit. This weekend is actually supposed to be pleasant and comfortable and tolerable. Okay, the time is 11.45 and I'm going to start uh, making bracelets right now. So I'm going to go get all the bracelet stuff and get all set up to do bracelets. Real quick, before I do that though, I need to just do a quick wipe down of over here of uh, our uh, sink and stove really quick. Just, just a quick wipe down, clean up.
after 1 o'clock. I just finished lunch. I needed a quick lunch break before I continued my charm bracelet. So far, I have all the charms. I'll actually show you. I have the charms on the little on the little pieces. Here's what I mean. I have the charms hooked on so I can put them on to the bangle over here. And I have a lot more of the attachments and, of course, a lot more charms. These are the charms that I picked out for my bracelet. A big charm that says, I love you. A sunshine, a moon and heart, a cross and a heart, a star, and never, never give up. Big charm. I think you have, when it comes to charm bracelets, a more reason to be creative, but also have meaning and more of a personal touch to these type of bracelets. Here is my finished bracelet. I brought it over to like, this is like our vinyl countertops um, for pictures, but I wanted to show you guys this is what it came out to look like. I decided to scrap out the Never Never Give Up charm. I'll use that on another bracelet. But you have the I Love You, the Heart and Moon, the Star, the Cross and the Heart, and then the Sunshine over here. This is a total of about five charms. And depending on the amount of charms that people want on their bracelets will depend on the price that I charge for each kind. I absolutely love how my bracelet came out. It's on my right hand, which is the one holding the camera, um, because I wear my tracker on this hand, on this wrist. But I love how it came out. Love how it came out, and I'm happy that this was actually super easy. I'll be honest. I'm glad that I took the approach of putting the charms on the expander parts first. That way it's one less step I need to worry about um, when it comes to actually assembling the bracelets on, or the charms on the bangle, how the, how the person wants. But I think it came out really good. I'm going to clean up my station over there and then uh, put my dishes away from lunch. I had um, some meatballs and pasta with some sauce. I'm going to clean all that up and then focus on editing this vlog and later on I will be posting the pictures that I took of this bracelet on my Facebook page also. Cleanup is finished. It is 1.49 and I need to put this pasta away. just want to say I apologize for the lack of filming. I think I have a headache from um, not really drinking enough water today, which is unusual for me. If you guys are wondering where I keep all my bracelet stuff. It's in this little bag temporarily. I do want to get those little like small drawstring bags for the bracelets that I make for people. Just as a little cutesy way. A cute way to display them and to package them for people. But for now, um, they're just gonna be given to people, not not in like plastic bags, but for now I'm just going to give them to people as they are until I get things in a, li in a little bit more running room or wiggle room, whatever you want to call it. Now it is 3.50 p.m. and I am outside getting some what's supposed to be fresh air, but it's humid air. I did not go for a walk today just because of the heat. 
Um, I may go for one this weekend. I don't know yet. Says it's supposed to rain tomorrow, but I'll double check. I don't know. But I'm going to be checking our mailbox and then finish edi editing this. It might be cut a bit short because I actually have a bad headache. I actually have this headache I've had for like, it's minor, but for like one or two hours. And I just took some Tylenol, so hopefully it evens it out. For what little breeze we have, I will say that it is really nice on my short hair. Um, the nice breeze definitely feels really good on the back of my neck. Somebody's mail went all over the grass that's over here. Let's see what we got in here. Really? Just this hospital thing? Well, at least we got something. But it's like just this hospital pamphlet magazine thing. Ugh. It's nothing. Oh my goodness. It is hot, hot, hot out here. I've only been out here for like five minutes. And... Whew! It's hot. Last I checked the weather, it was still about 90 degrees. Maybe 92. I'll be quiet. Look at that. I'm sweating and I've only been out here. Like, legit sweating. You see that right there? I'm going to go on ahead and this vlog. Sorry if it's short, but it's hot and I need to finish editing it for you. Thank you all so much for watching. Subscribe if you're not, and we'll see you next time.